Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? It's Ball Mike here, back with another video. So today I got you guys with the best stretch in 2K24. Man, this stretch is crazy. It has contact dunks. I'm gonna show you guys the way they did this uh, this year. The way they did the build is like you have to have some kind of vertical combined with driving dunk to have the contact dunks unlocked, especially as a big man. I'm gonna show you guys. This has contact dunks unlocked. Crazy three pointers play defense and as big man at 70 ball handling with 70 speed stamina at 90. I'm gonna show you guys this build is crazy and it's the best stretch in 2K24. If you guys like this type of videos, don't forget to like and subscribe. We're trying to get 4K subscribers, so if you're trying to grind the you're trying to join the grind, don't forget to like and subscribe. Bro, I already made my first build, but this is probably gonna be my second build I'm gonna play because I needed some kind of shooting build that has contact dunks. We're trying to get like contacts, so this could be my second build. So if y'all want this build as 99 overall, as if this is gonna be my second build, I'm gonna grind to 99 overall. Don't forget to put it in the comment section below. And if you guys have any modifications to this build, I can put it in the comment section below too. I would like to check it out, see if we could like uh, talk about it, which one is better, how we can improve it or not. And if not, we can make another build video, but this is crazy. Contact dunks, 90 something uh, mid range. We'll have all those Hall of Fame badge. I'm gonna show you guys now. Stretch, it's a stretch. Of course, we gotta put it to a center if you're trying to have a stretch. But yo, uh, I keep thinking the hands are just the positions, bro. Right? Uh, hands doesn't really matter, jersey number doesn't really matter. Now, right here, we're gonna put it to zero. We're gonna press continue. Now, it's gonna be center position, as I told you guys, right? Now, for the height, we have to put it small if you're trying to be a stretch. Not that, not, not to the shortest. We're gonna put it to six down right here. Keeping that solid and you're still a big man. Still have some strength, you're overall good. But we're gonna have a six now right here. Weight, do not change the weight. We're gonna keep it simple. We need the speed, but at the same time, we need the strength. So keep it 250. Because again, when you, when you increase it, you're gonna lose some speed. And when you decrease it, you're gonna get some speed, but again, you're gonna lose some strength. So 250 would be the straight ideal uh, height. Weight, tweaking, come on. But yeah, this is 250. Wingspan, we have to put it to seven foot. So put a seven foot right there. Right there, that's gonna give you more uh, mid range, more uh, three pointer. Because we are focusing on the, uh, like on the, like on the shooting. But again, we have contact dunks a lot, so do not worry. I'm gonna press continue. Now, really, you guys, you guys gotta follow me step by step. I'm gonna tell you guys why I, I put this at the Pacific number and so on and so forth. Now, for the close shot, we're gonna have a 90 close shot. Most people don't really notice this close shots because. They just most likely go for a driving layup and driving dunk, right? Close shots are one of the key factors for the finishing. I noticed that in 2K23. Now, when we have close shot as a 90, as soon as we hit it to 90, fast two, it's going to be a Hall of Fame. I mean, not a Hall of Fame. For Hall of Fame, it's actually going to need uh, a 98 close shot, which that's too much. So, gold, gold fast two is very good. Smashers, we're going to have it on gold. So, that's already good. Now, driving layup, we're not focused on too much driving layup, but we still need some kind of dri solid driving layup because we're a three-pointer uh, three person, but like, if we need to drive, we might need to go for a layup. But with contact dunks, we're gonna put it to an 89. I'm gonna show you guys this on the screen right here. These are all the contact dunks you guys need as a big man. So these are the attributes you guys can look at it. And right here, for that reason, we're gonna have it 89. 89 contact dunks right here. We have 89 contact dunks to get the the full contact us, we're gonna go to vertical and put it to a 78 vertical. 78 vertical right here. Now that unlocks the contact that already. Now we're gonna have a 90 standing dunk. Most people don't expect that, but we have a 90 standing dunk right here. Rise up, it's gonna be on gold, precision dunker. We got everything right here. Look at the finishing badge. Now, okay, we don't need post scoring, but we kind of need it at the same time because just in case, um like we need it because we are like we're a stretch but you know sometimes if y'all want to do some post scoring to get in the paint you guys should do 52 we're not the best but we're still chilling we have deeper on bronze just in case if you guys know how to use it it's toxic but y'all can use it with the bronze but this boat is not really focusing on that now mid-range we can have a 91 as soon as we put it to 91 look at this all this gold unlocking right here 91 guard up's gonna be hall of fame these are these are all the badges we're gonna lock just just through the mid-range. Now, now that we got all those badge, three-pointer, we're probably gonna be more like a spot-up. We do have a ball handling, but we're most likely gonna be a spot-up. We're gonna put it to an 83. Again, the mid-range gave you all the badge. So with the 83 three-pointer, you should be straight. Now, uh, free throw, put it to 68. Pass accuracy, put it to a 46. We don't really need pass accuracy too much. A solid pass accuracy should do. Now. Ball handling, we're a big man, but we're gonna put it to a 70. 70 ball handling for a center. 
is very solid. If we're going to be some kind of spot up, you guys have that option to play as a big man. Guard, guard big man, if that makes sense. But 51 ball with speed, so pass accuracy, 46, 70, and 51. Interior defense, 91 right here. Why is it 91? Because we're 6 9 we're mostly going to be matched up with big man, so we do need a solid interior defense. Now, not only that, um, we're going to have 87 block. That's a crazy block for a stretch. We don't really have stretch that'd be going for 87 blocks nowadays. 87 block. Now, defensive rebound, we're gonna have 83 defensive rebound. As soon as we have 83 defensive rebound, rebound chaser is gonna be on silver. From, 80, uh, from 82 to 83, rebound chaser is gonna be on silver. Of course, we have a rebound chaser, but we need some kind of offensive rebound. So we're gonna put that to a 65, just a solid 65. We don't, we don't need too much stuff, but we solid 65. Now, speed, we're 6'9", but we're a big man. We're gonna have a solid 70 speed. That's very good. 70 strength, another solid strength. And also for the vertical, we already told you at 78. And stamina, we can have it in 91. 91 right here. Now, you guys, here, I gave you guys a little bit of option. Now, you guys, you guys could max out the stamina to a 98 and max out the verticals and stuff, right? What you guys could do is, because on the physical, most, most people defer in how they play the game, right? You guys could uh, go for 91, because 91 is probably solid. Uh, 92 gets you the uh, workhorse, but other than that, you guys could choose around what to put it on. This is the, basically the main build, but it's not over with. To be honest with you, you guys could go for um, for more driving dunk, right? I gave you guys this two attributes to play around with it. Now, me personally, we have the contact dunks already unlocked, so I don't need too much contact dunk. 89 will be solid. Whatever your weakness is, I know most people are probably gonna go for the offensive rebound because it's 65. You guys could hit this offensive rebound, put it to a 75, right? It's you guys' choice. I gave you guys this option, but you guys fill up the rest as your choice. Most people don't really do this, but I gave you this flexibility basically to actually like play around with it. But that's the main build. Choose as you want. If you have any modification with this, which one is better, which one is not, you could put in the comment section below. But this build is crazy. Three pointer, crazy. Contact dunks majority are locked. We have the physicals. And we have the speed, we have the strength. Defense is crazy. This is a very good build. Now I'm gonna show you guys the, the build right here. Now, if you guys enjoy this type of video, which you are enjoying this type of video, don't forget to like and subscribe. We're trying to get 4K subscribers in 2K24. We grind into the top 10. So yeah, this is the build. As I told you guys, two-way, three-level threat. But again, you know that's a stretch. It's a big man that can shoot and play me. And contact him down. Come on, bro. He can play defense too. And if you guys enjoy this type of video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys more videos like this. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, try to get 4K subscribes. Yeah, I'm out.